Hey everybody, quick update on my little installation here. What I did is I, instead of connecting the inverter directly to the battery, I am using the, the load port, uh, load ports of this controller. So this way I have the panel connected here, the battery here, and the inverter is connected here. And the controller allows me to configure when the panel or how long uh, up to which voltage the panel is supposed to uh, charge the battery and then it turns the this port off here coming from the solar panel and it also allows me to configure when to turn on this load port and when to turn it off in order to um, in order to avoid that the battery is being getting depleted so this actually works quite well this charge controller is rated with 30 amp and what I'm drawing at night when I have all the lights and TVs and everything on is less than 300 volt uh, less than 300 watt it's around about 230 250 which equals um, so the, the inverter is pulling uh, 25 amps from the from the battery through the charge controller so this actually works well and I tried it already the only thing that I noticed with the battery it's not fully charging anymore and I think I have stored it too long before I installed the battery I got it in April and I finished this configuration in August so the battery has probably lost a bit of its capacity but anyway it's still working and yeah again this configuration works quite well just a little update take care guys let me know if you have questions bye